Yep, this is the right uh, place. I'm actually really glad I'm back to playing Assassin's Creed, by the way, because Watchdog, which um, I just finished playing Watchdogs, as I said in like the first or first two or three episodes. Um, but that doesn't really give you a feel of stealth as much as Assassin's Creed. It gives you the feel of just um, <coughs> sorry. It just gives you the feel of being able to use technology and stuff. Which may seem stupid because there is a lot of stealth in it, but it doesn't feel as rewarding as this game does. What the fuck? It's... It's this again. Why is it the forts that do this? It has to be something to do with the forts. Maybe I get to go in there sometime. Maybe that's... Oh! Oh! Oh, I get it now. Okay, this is my theory. I think once we turn Templar, we're going to be taking out these forts, and then we're going to be able to go inside because we're going to be taking control, and that's when we're going to get the chest. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Um, but as I was saying, Watch Dogs, unlike Assassin's Creed, Watch Dogs is really just about making sure you can get the enemy off guard, tasering them now and then, or if you're playing Watch Dogs 1, it's silencing pistol them. Um... But other than that, there's not really much stealth. In this one, you can actually hide in bushes, you can do all that shit, and you can hit and blade them, pull them in, stuff like that. Which feels a lot more, a lot more satisfying to me. <laughs> and just the fact you can climb up trees and stuff, starting from Assassin's Creed 3, it just feels so rewarding, it's not funny. The only reason I stopped playing Assassin's Creed after 4 is because I needed to play other games to uh, just get a grip of them. <laughs> yeah, you, are these French? I think they are. Bumba. So yeah, I think that's how we're going to get the fort. Hmm, where is it? Must be in one of those gates. Oh, oh, oh. How did no one notice that? How do I, um... How do I get in there? How are you? Oh, here you are. You know, I, I I'd really like this chest. Thank you. God, Shay, what are you doing? Thank you. Okay, progress further on this one more chest. Coolios. Meaning, oh, there's a, another prisoner of warship. I don't care about that. I'm gonna head over here. So, if, I've recently realized that destroying um, icebergs don't just give you rewards sometimes. They can also be used to destroy schooners and stuff, because when you destroy them, they uh, cause small waves. 
So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah. By the way, just in case anyone's wondering, because I recall this ahead of time, so I'm not going to be able to know. Um, if you guys are wondering why am I exploring this place before I've even properly started the game, because we're an assassin, we turn Templar. You, I think when we turn Templar is when the big things start happening. You may wonder why not just wait until them. My reply that I just randomly thought of was, um, what do you call it? was maybe when we turn Templar, different things will appear. So if we get stuff now, maybe we won't be able to get it later. And so I just want to be able to explore all the islands before we get into the big stuff. Because, honestly, the game could pull a nothing changed scenario. And all we all that's really changed is that everything turns restricted because we're Templars. Um, but at the same time, things could be added. And I'd be interested in that. Alrighty, so that's an Arctic hair. An alarm bell. It's prosperity. I really enjoy the prosperity stuff. If they're able to lower prices and stuff in stores, then I'd love that. Damn it. Sporting gentleman. Yeah, it's a sporting gentleman. Really? <laughs> Bumba. I'm just gonna steal all your money for when I turn evil. and one more prosperity. The chest is over here. Whoa! Oh, I actually hit people with that! I never hit someone with that before. I am so sorry. Oh! I didn't mean to do that. Oh, and the chest was up here the whole time. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't mean for that. <laughs> really, there's a bridge right there. Can you not climb that? Wow, that's uh, that's logic. So logical. Oh my god, this game's so logical. Breaks my mind. I can just see like a running scene happening here and we're being chased by something. I'm just saying. Oh, I'm climbing up here. Here we are. 
What the hell, Shay? I don't want to climb up that. I want to get on this rock. Thank you. And with those, two, well, four guards dead, technically. I think. Would you being hit by that package thing actually kill you? I think it would just injure you very badly. But that's just what I'm thinking. You never really know until you check the body, I guess. Men, we're out of here. I'm being chased. Kill them, men. Oh, wait, did they fall into the water? What the hell? <laughs> That's never happened before. That's actually never happened before. Hey, man. Men, fight. I want to. I want to see my men fight. Hey, man. <laughs> see ya. Hey, you. Damn it. Do you have any, um. What are they called? I don't know what they're called, actually. The long guns. The ones that shoot long range. I don't know. Captain Corona, cut the hair. Get the main says it to the wind. That slip will break us, sir. Look out. Find the horn, Ow. 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 Just want this place. Just want this place. Pull in the stunsel. Man, you shake. Bring it all in. I can go. Oh, is this place restricted? Nice. Very nice. Been a while since I've ran into a restricted area properly. Uh, there's an animus fragment, like, right there. I'd love it if there was, like, an animus fragment that when you put your ship in the position of the docking, it turns out it's right on your mast. And so you have to go to the top of your ship to get it. That'd be funny. Hey. How are you? Ah, it didn't work. I was gonna try to get up there. Oh, there's an arrow that's fucking up there. Um, I was gonna try to get up and double assassinate them, but it didn't work. Okay, there's that. Oh, uh, there's a wall letter here. Um, the Animus Fragment that I want. Boomba. 
There's a treasure map. That's interesting. Once we get all the islands before them, besides the main mission one. Wait, did that say New York? I swear that just said New York. No, North Atlantic? No, hang on. Uh, next. Yeah, New York. <laughs> well, um, before we do the main mission island, but once we've done all the others, I will try landing down all these treasure map areas. Because I assume we can go to them. Unless, of course, we keep them after whatever happens to make us change. In which case, okay then. Sea shanty. Because if there's one in the far right corner, which is the one we need the snow break, um, snow break ram thing, um, then okay, I can understand that. But if not, then cool, I can get them all. But I don't know. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yeah, I've, uh... I've lost it. See ya. That was weird. That was embarrassing and weird. God damn, this is like annoying. It's on a ledge, so... How do cakes create explosions? Where? Where are powder cakes? This? Uh, I don't think that's a powder cake. You lost your brother. I didn't use my hidden blades, though. I used my fists. Does uh, Shay not know how to use his fists to kill an animal? Is he that in love with weapons? Because, okay, I guess. Yeah. Boom, boom. Okay, so there's two chests. One's pro yeah, one's up here. Bumba. I love how I'm getting so much money for the future. That's what I love about these open world games. They give you so much chance to get so much money. I don't know anyone who's done this, so keep in mind there may not be people who've done this before, but if there are people out there that complain about open world games like Assassin's Creed not giving you the chance to get enough money to get things and so you fail missions because you don't have the right items, take a look at my Assassin's Creed Let's Plays and see how fast it takes me to get to like 20,000 cash without even doing the main story. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it is so bloody easy, it's not funny. All you have to do is explore and not rush the missions. That's literally all you have to do. Boomba. And I think this is the last thing. Besides the viewpoint. Which I don't think I've done yet. Is this the viewpoint? Yeah, this is the viewpoint. Okay, so two more chests. One of them's nearby. And the other one not so nearby, just outside the restricted zone. Oh, uh, it's down there. Ah. 
Boomba. I wonder. Nope. Not a secret path. It was possible. It was very possible. But it did not happen. Oh, it's in him. Okay. I'm surprised there's not a cave painting or stuff in there. It's funny because the map makes it look like it's a huge island, but it isn't. It really isn't. It's so tiny. That's hilarious. Thank you. 